Leonardo DiCaprio had a piece of Warren's cherry pie Dixon Bobby Brown memoir. Some intimate details of Leonardo DiCaprio's sex life has been revealed in a new memoir. Bobby Brown, who is best known for starring in Warren's racy cherry pie music video in 1990, said she got up close and personal with the A-list actor when he was 19 years old. I unbuttoned his jeans and tugged down on his boxers. What I saw made me gasp. It made no sense. The kid put Tommy Lee to shame, the model wrote in her book Dirty Rocker Boys, Love and Loved on the Sunset Strip. After DiCaprio met Brown at the VIP lounge of the Grand Phil Club in Hollywood in the early 90s the pair supposedly went back to her house, put on TLC's hit song Waterfalls and began to get undressed. Brown, who was in her mid-twenties at the time shared that DiCaprio asked her if she had been tested for sexually transmitted diseases. So Bobby, do you have any diseases? Also what about gonorrhea? Have you been tested for that? She shared. Waves of satisfaction rippled through my body. If only Tommy Lee could see me now, she continued in the tell-all referring to her famous ex that reportedly left her for Pamela Anderson. He was a unicorn. Rare, innocent, and horny. Me, on the other hand, I'd been engaged, married and had given birth. I needed a man, not a man-child. Brown, who had been married to Warren lead singer Johnny Lane for three years, said she cut her tryst with the great Gatsby star short and did not sleep with him. She claimed the reason was because he made her feel uncomfortable that she was older than him. The now 44-year-old blonde's book is filled with pages discussing her battle with drugs and several accounts of the many men in Hollywood that she dated.